Hi guys, it's Bonnie, and welcome to Hardcore Destruction Weird Phones episode 13. Yep, the amount of episodes in this series caught up to my age in under a year. You're not dreaming. But anyways, for this episode, we have this iPhone 5, as you can see. And would you look at this? Finally, a phone that works and isn't passcode locked on this series about freaking time. So you know what that means, we gotta do a review on this phone, of course. So without any further delay, let's get on to that. Turning this guy on. And as always, we gotta do the camera first, of course. Oh, what beautiful photo quality. It totally don't look like absolute shite or anything. What are you guys talking about? Anyways, taking the photo in 3, 2, 1. Nice. How nice, how beautiful. Now it's on to a video with the back camera. And before I could finish the video, the phone died. Isn't that beautiful? That's what you get out of a 9-year-old battery, I guess. I swear, it was like 10% a minute ago, and in one minute, it dropped from 10% to zero. How pathetic is that? Welp, the phone died before I even got to really do anything on it. Isn't that just the most fun thing in the universe? I swear, the universe is just against me doing proper reviews on any phone. Why the hell am I having this problem? But with that, looks like we're forced to skip to the drop test now, so let's get it. Alright, so first up is always, you know the drill, we're getting into the drop test on this thing. Waist height backside drop in 3, 2, 1. Waist height corner side drop in 3, 2, 1. Perfect. Oh wow, immediately we get a reaction like that. That's fun. And the final waist height drop, waist height face down. This will really test the durability of the iPhone 5. Damn it, wasn't perfect. Beautiful. Welp, it didn't land fully on the face, but we still got a reaction. That is just looking so beautiful up there, isn't it? Chest height backside in 3, 2, 1. Oh, clean. The corners are just having such a great time all around, aren't they? Chest height corner in 3, 2, 1. Nice. Yep, my theory about the corners just having the most beautiful time in the universe holds true. And the final chest tight drop, chest tight face down. Let's do this, biatches. Oh, I saw the screen and it is not having a fun time. <laughs> Welp, can I say I'm surprised? Not really. But hey, if it makes you feel any better, the LCD is still fine. I don't know if you can even see that. And would you look at that? It's working, even though it displayed the battery warning that it needed to be charged a minute ago. That's Apple logic for you, people. Six foot backside. Oh, glass came out of the screen. That's fun. Six foot corner, which will most likely fail. Yep, to be expected. It's my 12th piece of abstract art. Would you look at how beautiful that is? The final drop, six foot face down. Let's get this show on the road, bitches. That was so clean, it's not even funny. 
I noticed that the screen is like bulging out a little bit from that. That is just so beautiful. I love everything about that. You see this? And now you know what time it is. It's time for the ludicrous drop test. I have no idea if the slow-mo caught that or not, but let me tell you, that was beautiful. So, here's the deal with the front. Surprise, surprise, more glass is missing, and with the back, glass is missing from there too. Beautiful. Okay, so you guys are gonna be genuinely pissed about this. Look. The cunt still works. No, this doesn't even compute in the slightest. And as you can notice, I'm in the bathroom right now, so you already know what this is leading to. A good old fashioned water test. Okay, and to ensure that the phone stays on while we do this, you see, I'm going to go in here and start recording video. Oh, you know what? Scratch that. The camera's bricked. The camera's bricked. Look, it's just dark. Nothing. Okay, in that case, we'll just leave it in the camera. Why the hell not? Yaw, yeet. Oh, the screen's starting to go kind of weird. That looks so beautiful, doesn't it? Oh, it just continues to get worse and worse. Die, you cunt. How it is still on right now absolutely blows my mind. Like, you kid? Look at this. Look at this. This can't be happening. The screen's all shattered. It's got pieces of glass missing even. And yet, it's still alive. How is it not totally dead right now? Maybe we can change that. Oh, yep, that is clearly getting worse. Oh, it just opened Siri randomly. Oh, you almost dead, bud? <laughs> Those lines just keep getting look worse and worse. <laughs> Come on, it's best to just give in and die. Wouldn't you all agree? Backside? Oh my god, I can still touch the screen and everything. It's almost done. It is almost done. Oh, you see that? You see that? Only like an eighth of the display is working right now. So all we need is just for you to freaking die. That's all you need to do. It's just give in and die. It is grasping onto life like a 126 year old man right now. Come on, just die already. What's so difficult about just giving in and accepting your fate, huh? Phone. Oh, you see that? Now this is what I like to call abstract art. It's incredible. It's actually incredible. Hardcore destruction has count them zero survivors. We can't allow this. We can't see anything on the actual screen anymore, so that's not good. Die. Die. Go ahead and just accept your fate and die. It's best if you give in, phone. I'm just gonna tell you, like right now. Oh, yes, yes. One tiny purple line remains. Time to go to the pool, everybody. That's it, it's off, it's done, it's done. Finally. Finally, we made this phone crack. Actually, scratch that. As soon as I stopped the water, look what happened. It came back to life. We can't have this. We just can't. 
Well, water clearly doesn't kill this thing, so looks like we'll have to move on to a more destructive method. Guys, are you seeing this? Look, the display's slowly starting to come back. I mean, I can't touch anything, but you can see the time and everything. And it's correct, too. Today's September 4th, 4.32 p.m., yep. Okay, no bout a doubt the fact that this thing 100% has my respect. Like, seriously, I don't think a single phone has ever passed a water test in this series. This is the first. Look at this, the lines are fading even more, like you can barely even tell they're there. Okay, so that water test just proved that the old phones are just as water resistant as the new ones. Okay guys, so now to continue with this thing, for those of you who don't know, I asked my Discord server for suggestions on how to break this thing, and amazingly, I actually got more than one suggestion. I know, so shocking. But anyways, the first suggestion is to dance on the phone. Sure, why the hell not? I don't know what the hell kind of dance this is. Yeah. I don't know what the hell kind of dance this is. Fuck no, are you kidding me? Look, the display's perfectly fine. It's back to normal completely after the water test. How? That just doesn't even compute in my mind at all. All right, the next suggestion is... Wow, you really put a lot of freaking time before telling me what it was gonna be. But sure, why the hell not? Damn it! Why didn't you jump, Mario? Oh, that is promising. Is it finally finished? Yep, that's the exact kind of result I expected. <laughs> But do you see this? Look, there are tiny bits of the screen that still have life. That is just... How? I don't even have any words at this point. I'm gonna do the other well-known meme that correlates with this being a phone more. Oh, what's that? You're breaking up with me? Oh! Oh, God! Do you see that? Look! It's showing it. Look, do you see this? Do you see, like, the light? Let me try and get a better view of it. And, of course, as soon as I tried to show you, it shut off. <laughs> Alright, you know what? It probably would be in my best interest to take out the battery now, so, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. God damn it, Isabel! Why'd you have to break up with me, you bitch? Oh! <laughs> would you look at that? Now that's what I call removing the battery like a pro. <laughs> you see this? From this, the battery's already popping out, and from there we can just, boom, done. That's removing the battery like a pro, people. <laughs> Shit like that deserves to be on Dude Perfect, wouldn't you agree? <laughs> Welp, water didn't kill it, but all my crazy ass friend's suggestions did. <laughs> Next suggestion, throw it at your mom after all the abuse. Gee, I totally have never done that one before. Where the hell is my iPhone SE? I've been looking for it all day. Mom, do you have something to do with this? Okay, so I may have pawned it to buy some more beer and drugs. Bitch, I should've known. I should've known a horrible mother like you would pull something like that. I do have this iPhone 5, so this gives me a good idea. I already know what's coming. Just do it already and get it over with. You chose to pawn my phone, so now I'm gonna pawn you! Ah! Little shit! And from that, the screen came off. Beautiful. And the last suggestion, 
cook it and eat it. <laughs> well, I obviously can't cook it because my grandparents would have my fucking hide, but... Ugh, tastes like shit. Okay, so after that, I'm gonna include a way of my very own. Hey, Bonnie! Oh no, not you again. Look at my brand new iPhone 5, it's like totally super. Bitch, that phone literally came out like nine years ago. You better buy an iPhone 5 like right now or like feel my wrath. Oh, I'll tell you exactly what I think of that piece of anal fluid 5. Hand it over! Hey, be careful with my, like, totally super phone. Oh, I'll be sure to be careful with it. Yaw, yeet! Oh my god! Why did I not have slow-mo for that? Damn it, of course the one time I don't have a slow-mo is the one time something absolutely incredible happens. Do you see that? Welp, I'd say that about does it for this five, so time to finish it off now, I guess. Let's go! Oh, God damn it, you're serious? You're actually serious that this actually happened again? Oh my fucking God. Six and a half hours later. Aha, there you are finally, and you're with that skank of a camera? God damn it, man. I don't want to go through this again. I'm still recovering from my broken hand last time, for fuck's sake. How dare you call my future wife a skank? I dare. I think it would be in your best interest if you just stopped right now and cancelled this video. I'm not scared of either one of you, and I have no reason to be. You want to take that back? It's two against one here. You want it's to take two that back? small it's ass two against pieces one of tech here. versus one big ass five foot six, one hundred sixty pound man. You tell me how that's gonna end. You're one hundred and sixty pounds. Ha ha, fat ass. I'm not fat. I'm just heavy. All right. What's the difference? That tears it. Your little boyfriend is coming with me now. Oh no, he isn't. Oh shit! That's my other hand. Ah, damn it! What am I gonna do now that both my hands are broken? I'm just a helpless little baby at this point. Yeah, cry little baby. What to do? What to do? There's nothing you can do, Mr. Studios. Oh, please. Mr. Studios is my father. And speaking of, Dad, I'm getting bullied out here. Who the hell is picking on my son? We are. Oh, you two messed up now. Bonnie, where's that motherfucking hammer at? Right over there, Pops. Also, if you thought I was big, my dad is six foot nine at 420 pounds. Oh, oh you, you stupid, stupid Nick. Say it with me, people. You just got fucked. Thank you guys so much for watching Hardcore Destruction Weird Phones episode 13. The amount of episodes in this series finally caught up to my age. We did it, people. With all the shit the Vixia has done to me at this point, I'm thinking that Hardcore Destruction Vixia isn't the worst video idea right now. <laughs> But thank you guys again for watching, and I'll see you next time with Hardcore Destruction Weird Phones Episode 14. Goodbye, guys. Oh. Welp, this probably decides the fate of the Vixia right here.